Hi. So a lot of you guys have asked me how about I'm animating. So today I will show you guys how I animating my animations with Adobe Animate CC. So let's start with the basic things that you have to know. I like to set my project size in 800 multiply 450 pixels because in Adobe Animate we can render this animation in HD quality later. Or if you're not okay with the size, you can just set your size on properties right here. For the basic tools, what you really need to know is uh, selection tools right here. That is the main thing that can select your drawing in this program and move things around. It also have options to help your drawing to become smoother or straight. Brush tool that I use the most on my line art when I am animating. Paintbrush tools that I use to color on my animations. Uh, like if you want this ball to have shadows, you just use this paintbrush to make a zone for your color and use paint bucket tools to color it. I'll make it pink and purple. Yeah. And you use selection tools, select all of it, and click select color for pencil and select clear color. Here is your beautiful cutie ball. But if you want to animate, you have to know about timeline and keyframes in this program. To insert keyframes in this program, we have three shortcuts. F5 to make your keyframe longer. F6 to build the same new keyframe. And F7 to build a new clear keyframe. And if you want to delete keyframe, you just Right click the keyframe that you want to delete and select remove frames. It will gone. And now it's time for how do I animate part. I use two techniques to make my animations. It is frame by frame and tweening animations. For frame by frame, I'm gonna make a basic ball bouncing animation. If you're interested, you can animate along with me. First. Add a new keyframe using F6. Then draw your ball or use oval tool is okay too. Next that you have to know, you have to draw a middle frames and the end frames to make it more easy to draw in between frames. So I'm gonna draw when the ball hit the floor and using the same frame with the end frame. Next, draw in between frames. So in this part, I like you to Think about when the ball bouncing. Yeah, it's gonna be slow first and fast. Hit the floor, bounce up fast, and another slow down. So we gonna animate like that. The tip of this part, you have to know that if we draw close, it's gonna be slow. And if you drawing far from each other, it gonna be fast. And here is your loop bouncing ball. Look how cute is it? In the tweening part, you guys will see a lot of these techniques in my channel because um, um, I'm lazy to draw. So mm, let's start to know about symbols. I'll use my ball that I used uh, before here too. Okay, so use selection tools to select all the ball. Right click it and select convert to symbols. It will have this pop up on your screen. In this program, we have three types of symbols to use. One, button that use a lot on flash games. But I, I will won't teach you guys these symbols because um, I'm, too, I'm too new to use. Two, movie clip that will give you more options to play in this program. Such as blur, glow, or drop shadows. And the stars of all of the symbols type. Graphics. On graphics, we can animate on the symbol, and it will have an animation in the symbols that you can use whenever you want to. So for the tweening, I'm gonna make this cutie ball float left to right. First, you have to insert frames by press F6. Make the first frame and the last frame. Right click at your timeline and select create classic tween. Then your ball will move left to right. Yay! But for the tweening, 
we have more to play on easting. The basic ease that you have to know on this program is ease in and ease out. Ease in, it will make your drawings move in slow then fast. But ease out, it will make your drawing move out fast and slow down. If you find a good way to use it in your training animations, you can also make animation like this. Or this. For more techniques, I recommend you guys to go check out Alan Baker's tutorials channel. He's so good at animating. I hope this video helped you. Good luck on animating everyone. See ya!